Guys okay so we need to talk about this, for like 2 years now it's been everywhere. Whispers at first, you know? People scared, people confused, doctors saying one thing, but then your weird aunt on Facebook saying another. We're talking about the COVID-19 vaccine, and the absolutely bonkers conspiracies surrounding it, like seriously insane, but we have to talk about it. So buckle up you guys, because we are about to go on a wild ride. The top 10 wildest, craziest, most unbelievable COVID-19 vaccine conspiracies out there. Just before we dive in, we would love for you to subscribe to our channel so you can keep up with more interesting videos like this one. Also click that notification bell so when we post a new video, you'll be the first to know. Now let's do this thing. Okay, so number 10 on our list. People are saying the government is using the vaccine to implant microchips. Microchips, you guys, like we're dogs. I know it sounds crazy, right? But people are convinced. They think the government wants to track our every move, and they're using the vaccine to do it. We have nine more conspiracies to get through, and they just get crazier from here. Number nine on our list is seriously messing with my head, you guys. It's the idea that the vaccine can actually alter your DNA, like, change who you are on a fundamental level. What if this vaccine isn't just a vaccine, what if it's some kind of gene editing tool? People are saying it's a way for the government, or whoever is behind this, to create a whole new race of humans, or to control our thoughts and emotions by manipulating our genes. It sounds insane, I know, but there's all this scientific jargon being thrown around online, and it's hard to tell what's real and what's not. And the scariest part is, we don't really know what the long-term effects of this vaccine could be. What if it does change our DNA? What if it has consequences we can't even imagine yet? This is some Black Mirror level stuff, you guys. Okay, this next one is especially scary for anyone who wants to have kids someday. We're talking about the conspiracy theory that the COVID-19 vaccine causes infertility. Like, you get the shot and bam, you can't have children anymore. People are saying that the vaccine contains ingredients that are toxic to reproductive organs or that it triggers an autoimmune response that attacks sperm or eggs. There are all these stories circulating on social media people claiming that they know someone who knows someone who became infertile after getting vaccinated. But is there any truth to it? Or is it just mass hysteria? It's hard to say for sure. The idea of a vaccine potentially robbing people of their ability to have children is just chilling. Number 7. Wait. Magnets? Okay, you guys, this next one is just… weird. People are claiming that the COVID-19 vaccine makes you magnetic. Yes, you heard that right. Apparently after getting vaccinated people are sticking magnets, spoons, even phones to the injection site. Some people are saying that the vaccine contains metallic nanoparticles that are attracted to magnets. Others believe that it's some kind of government experiment gone wrong, or even evidence of alien technology. Is it real? Is it fake? Is it just a bunch of people messing around online? I don't know, but it's definitely entertaining to watch. Number 6. They just want to control us. This next conspiracy theory is a big one, guys. It's the idea that the COVID-19 vaccine is part of a government plot to control us. Believers think the vaccine tracks our movements and suppresses freedoms. They see it as a way for the government to exert more control. Is it really so crazy to think the government might use a vaccine to further their agenda? Some point to vaccine mandates as evidence of this control grid. Is it true, or just paranoia run wild? Number 5. Wait, the vaccine causes COVID? There are people out there who believe that the COVID-19 vaccine actually causes COVID-19. The thing that's supposed to protect you from the virus is actually giving you the virus. People point to anecdotal evidence claiming that they know someone who got COVID after being vaccinated. But here's the thing. Correlation does not equal causation. Scientists and medical experts have debunked this theory repeatedly, explaining that the vaccines do not contain the live virus and therefore cannot cause COVID-19. But despite the evidence, this conspiracy persists, highlighting the power of misinformation in the digital age. Okay, this next conspiracy theory is a wild one even for conspiracy theory standards. We're talking about the belief that 5G technology is somehow linked to COVID-19. 5G, the next generation of wireless technology is supposedly causing the pandemic. People were, and some still are, 
convinced that the electromagnetic radiation emitted by 5G towers was either weakening our immune systems or even transmitting the virus itself. Of course, there is absolutely no scientific evidence to support this claim. Scientists and health experts have repeatedly debunked this theory, explaining that 5G technology poses no threat to human health. But that hasn't stopped the conspiracy from spreading like wildfire online. Number 3. They're putting what in there? Part 2. We're talking about the belief that the COVID-19 vaccines contain aborted fetal tissue. This theory has been circulating online for months, fueled by religious objections to abortion and a general distrust of the pharmaceutical industry. While it's true that some vaccines in the past have used fetal cell lines which are cells grown in a lab from tissue originally collected decades ago, the COVID-19 vaccines do not contain any aborted fetal tissue. This has been confirmed by scientists, health experts, and even religious leaders. However, the misinformation persists, often spread through social media and online forums. It's a complex and sensitive issue, and it's important to approach it with empathy and understanding, even if you disagree with the theory itself. Number 2. Side effects? More like death effects. This next conspiracy theory plays on people's fears about vaccine side effects. We all know that vaccines can sometimes cause mild side effects like pain at the injection site, fever, or fatigue. But some people believe that the COVID-19 vaccines are causing severe, even deadly, side effects. Stories about people experiencing debilitating illnesses, developing autoimmune disorders or even dying after getting vaccinated have been circulating online, fueling fears about the safety of the vaccines. While it's important to acknowledge that some people do experience adverse reactions to vaccines, it's crucial to put these cases into context. Serious side effects from the COVID-19 vaccines are extremely rare, and the vast majority of people experience only mild, temporary side effects. But it's important to rely on credible sources of information and to avoid spreading misinformation that could scare people unnecessarily. Number 1. They want to wipe us out. And now for the most chilling conspiracy theory of them all, the belief that the COVID-19 vaccine is part of a sinister plan to depopulate the world. Some people believe that the vaccine is a bioweapon designed to kill off a significant portion of the global population. Proponents of this theory claim that the vaccines are laced with toxins or that they're designed to cause mass infertility, slowly reducing the world's population over time. However, there is absolutely no evidence to support this claim. The idea that governments and scientists around the world would conspire to kill off millions of people is simply not credible. The depopulation conspiracy theory is a dangerous example of how misinformation can have real-world consequences. We must also make mention of the conspiracy that the COVID vaccine is the mark of the beast from the Book of Revelation. According to this one, getting vaccinated is part of some grand apocalyptic plan. But rest assured folks, the vaccine is not a mark of anything except your commitment to public health. And have you heard this one? The vaccine will turn you into a zombie? Yes, some people genuinely believe that getting vaccinated will turn you into the next star of The Walking Dead. There are so many more far-fetched conspiracies about the vaccine, some that we haven't even mentioned. We just went through some of the wildest, most unbelievable COVID-19 vaccine conspiracies out there. But here's the thing. It's important to remember that these are just theories. They're not necessarily true. And in many cases, they've been debunked by experts. We can talk to our doctors. We can listen to scientists. We can rely on credible sources of information. And most importantly, we can think critically and not believe everything we read online. So there you have it, folks, the 10 wildest conspiracies about the COVID vaccine. Remember, while these theories are wild and sometimes funny, it's important to stick to the facts and trust the science. If you enjoyed this video or learned anything from it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more content, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Stay safe, stay informed, and we'll see you in the next video.